Hey guys, I'm Patrick Walsh, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you six mind blowing websites and digital tools that you probably had no idea existed. Starting off with the first tool, which is called Whiteboard. So, what Whiteboard allows you to do is if you're on a Zoom call, you can actually draw and share illustrations. You know, it's just a really easy way to get your point across. As you can see, I'm doing it right now. And you can make those adjustments. You know, of course, you can er erase things, as the Americans would say, remove, <laughs> rub out. Um, and then, of course, you, you can write text as well. So, you know, I can write these details here, where to follow me on social media. Um, incredibly useful. And of course, you can undo things as well. You've got a line tool. So it's just really quick and simple. I really like using this. It's a great way when you're trying to explain something, you know, on a Zoom call, when normally you'd have a pad to hand, you can just do it here on the screen. The next tool is called Blush. And this is a tool I wish I'd known about sooner. It's honestly incredible. This is probably my favorite of the bunch, apart from the very last tool that I'm gonna show you. But this one in particular, what you can do is it just allows you to create illustrations quickly and easily. So I'll just click this Create Random. Uh, and what you'll see is it populates with these illustrations and then you can change everything about the illustrations. So you can change, you know, the facial expression, you can add a beard, uh, you can even add a mask to this particular chap that we've got here. We can give him some hair. And so you can create these illustrations really quickly, really simply. And there's a whole range. You've got collections up here. Um, let's just take, you know, money verse. And so we can select this person just to show you another example. Uh, we will click edit. And then we can go ahead and actually change, you know, now they're holding a credit card. We can change their trousers to a different color. Uh, we can change, you know, the head on the illustration. So it's just a really quick, simple way to make illustrations for a website, for a book, for any project at all. You can add a background, you know, you can change the hair color, you can change the skin tone as well. So really incredible, so quick and easy to use. Uh, this tool, I wish I'd known about this tool sooner. It's absolutely phenomenal. The next tool is called Cover with two R's, cover.co. And what this is, is it's completely free stock video footage. So you can use this for YouTube videos like this one, Instagram, TikTok, whatever you would like to create video for. Again, they have collections as well, which is really great because you could pick uh, something in particular. So maybe let's search for books see what they've got when it comes to books. Um, and there you go, you've got content related to books, as you can see, related Shutterstock videos, um, you know, more free stock videos. So it's really quick, it's really simple. With this website in particular, you don't have to credit the creator or anything like that. So it is completely royalty free. Okay, so next up we have card.co. This is card with an extra R. And this allows you to create websites really quickly and really simply. So if we just go ahead and click choose a starting point, you'll see how simple this is. We can then go ahead and just choose a blank canvas. Um, so I'm gonna select this one here. And then what we can go ahead and do is just simply make some adjustments. So if we click on text, it pops up there. And then I can just put my name instead. And then you can add, you know, the text that you want here as well. Um, you know, we can say this, this is my website. Whatever you wanna add, you can add a photo in here, you know, change that uh, as well. You can put your social media links. It's really quick, really simple to get a website up and running. So if you just want a simple landing page for a project, an author website, whatever it may be that you're trying to build really quickly, I think card is an amazing way to do it. I wish I'd found this again much sooner rather than fiddling around with WordPress and you know some of the other solutions that are out there. So card.co, great way to just get a website up and running really easily and cheaply. Next up, we have untools.co. So what this is, is it's a decision making framework. So they offer a number of different ways to help you make a decision. So we can click on, let's say six thinking hats. Um, and it's how to look at a decision from different perspectives. So they explain, you know, how to use this decision making framework, they give you an example and then they give you the key 
takeaway. This is so useful for when you have decisions and you're trying to figure out what the best way forward is. Another example, you know, find a win-win um, solutions to conflicts. You know, I think this website is absolutely incredible. How to prioritize your actions using the Eisenhower matrix to figure out, you know, what's important and what's urgent. So this is a really, really cool tool for deciding, you know, what you should be working on or how to make decisions, difficult decisions that you might be facing. Okay, and then the final tool, number six, which is my personal favorite of the entire list, is called tweethunter.io. I only found this a few weeks ago and it has absolutely transformed my Twitter account. So it has a huge number of features, but I'm gonna give you just you know a few of the main things uh, that this does and then you can go and of course explore the app. So they give you this checklist, which is really handy when you first sign up to let you know, you know here's what you need to be doing to actually grow your Twitter account. Um, but the best part of this app is they have a daily inspiration part of the app and it gives you inspiration for amazing tweets that have already done really well and then you can of course not copy them but use that as inspiration for your own Twitter threads, your own Twitter posts and you edit the personalized feed with <clears throat> what you want to talk about. So for me, writing, authors, books, publishing, I click save and it's gonna find me popular tweets that have featured that topic. It uses artificial intelligence, so it's not always 100% accurate, but it just gives you great inspiration to then go off and you know, produce something of your own. So for example, here's the ROI of reading books. That would be an excellent one that's relevant for us. So all I have to do is click edit and tweet it pops it in here. Of course, it won't let you tweet it because I've just copied it across. But then the goal is to take that idea, take that framework, edit it into something that suits me and suits my business. And then of course I can share that once I've changed it and made it my own. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you have. Make sure to subscribe. I look forward to seeing you in future videos.